Good morning, good morning. How are you? Welcome to Star Woman Artistry and Star Woman Tarot and Oracle. I'm here to read your daily oracle and your daily tarot cards. So I'm reading from the Dark Mirror Oracle and the Dark Goddess Oracle. So these two oracles tend to, you know, touch on our lower vibrational energies. So I got drawn to them to read for them today, okay? To read from them today. So here I am. So then I'm also going to read your tarot from the Under the Roses Lenormand Tarot. So let's see what the Dark Mirror has to say. So they may be, there may be some stuff you need to work on. They're going to talk about some you know, lower vibrational things surrounding you, okay? So let's see what they have to say. Oh, here we go. It just flipped out. Masquerade. Masquerade, okay? So either you're wearing a mask or somebody's wearing a mask, you're not being your true authentic self, or there's somebody who isn't being their true authentic self around you, okay? They're hiding themselves under a masquerade. They're putting on airs, they're putting on a show, all right? So somebody is putting on a show around you. They're hiding their feelings, I feel. Um, they're not telling you how they really feel. Um, they're putting on this guarded mask. You know, there's some sort of... Um, energy around that you know when people feel they have to shield their true nature their true selves you know um they're hiding something from you okay so i feel it could be feelings it could be um it could also be maybe they're maybe they don't like you right so maybe it's their you know they're pretending to like you but they don't you know that could be as well okay so you got here persephone and compliance persephone and compliance so they I feel this is them on their part. They may be just going with the flow and just dealing with things, trying not to ruffle the waters, you know, trying not to ripple anything. And, you know, as the water flows around you, but it's, it's just like they're in compliance with this masquerade. Okay. They're agreeing to not show themselves. Whatever's happening between you and this person, um, they're just going along with it. You know, maybe they're, they're waiting on you to make the first moves or you to let your guard down. You know, they're going to follow through with whatever you're doing is what I feel. They're in compliance with something. Um, they may be under an agreement. Um, there may be something over their head so that they are not showing who they truly are they're they're putting on a false face so that um they're going along it could be in a workplace environment it could be in family you know sometimes that happens right people are under um duress of some sort and you know they're not showing their true natures so i do feel that there is some sort of masquerade going on here as their cards are saying they're somebody's not tr showing their true nature is a bottom line. I've said that several times already. They're not showing their true self. They're not showing the heart of themselves. They're not letting their true light shine who they really are, okay? They're hiding this, but they're doing it because they feel they have to comply with the social norms, the social more. You know, it could be workplace culture. It could be something where they feel that they're being suppressed and, and you know, they're under duress. So they are in compliance with something, and they're hiding how they really feel, okay, or how they really think, how they really view the world, how they really are to the world, because, you know, maybe they feel attacked on some level, you know, and that could be why people put up false faces as well, right? There's some sort of um, thing they don't feel comfortable with, so they're putting on an air, putting on, a, you know, up the guards, putting the walls up a little bit, so, you know, and, and it's, an, it's, they're dealing with some stuff, so you, if you're, have a person that's been very guarded with you that has been avoidant of you that is a like does not want to deal with you anymore think about what's been happening for them you know when did this stuff start you know like it, it's just like you got to really investigate that sometimes especially if you are truly interested in this person but this could also be you you could also be going along with this masquerade you could also be in compliance with what's happening here because you don't want to stand up yet and say hey you know what this is who i really am fuck you guys right uh so you are you know wanting to go in compliance you don't want to ripple any feathers or ruffle any feathers as they say or ripple the water right you know because right now you're not ready to do that you're not ready to show people who you truly are the true source of your nature you know maybe you're afraid people aren't going to like what they see you know but whatever it is you're going along you're taking guidance and, and uh, direction from other people and you're just moving along with the crowd right so it's up to you whether or not you're going to let that all down or when it's going to come down so let's see what the lenormand has to say here okay 
to see if this also falls in, into place, but we'll see. Somebody thinks your wish fulfillment, right? Guarded, guarded, being guarded. That's the word I'm hearing, being guarded, okay? Lenormand Tarot, I usually like to read from five cards, gives more of a direct story. And Lenormand Tarot is very blunt, very blunt messages, straightforward. There's no pussyfooting around, right? So, you know, and because these card, these oracles today deal with more darker vibrational energies, uh, lower vibrational energies, maybe this person is just going along because they feel like they've been, their light has been, you know, diminished for some reason, right? You got to think about that. What something happened for them to be putting the masquerade on, all right? So here we are. Oh, wow. Yes. Okay. So there is somebody you think about or she or they think about you, okay? Um, you are on somebody's mind or somebody's on your mind, okay? You do want to have a fresh start with them and that's okay. And you, I think you want to have like a good solid connection with them, but... I think there's options around this situation, okay? Or somebody thinks there's options around the situation. Um, and there may be uh, some sort of, um, you know, how it's like an island, right? So there's a lot of emotions surrounding this situation. But somebody may be feel, might feel left out in the cold. You know, like they're not, there's no full connection there yet is what I'm feeling. But there's a decision that's going to be made you may be standing at a crossroads or they may be, there may be some financial stuff going on because you got the queen of pentacles there. So they may be focusing more on their business, more on their career and moving forward with that than focusing on love. Okay. They may be making that decision to do that. So you need to be aware of that. But this person does think you are wish fulfillment. Okay. You do, you know, tick all the boxes. You make them go tickety boom. Okay. So they do feel that connection with you. Um, and they do hope that one day it can, you know, <clears throat> transpire into something. Right. But at this point in time, there is going to be an offer. Okay. It would, there will be an offer. This person's going to take action on it, or you're going to take action on making this offer uh, to this person, but there is going to be some sort of apology, some sort of, um, I always feel like there's music whenever I look at this, but it's a tablecloth. But whenever I see it, I always feel it's like something musical. So music might connect you guys. Um, or some sort of creative endeavor, okay? It's some creativity. There's a creative aspect to this. Or maybe you need to be creative in your offer with this person, you know, that kind of thing. But I do feel whatever um, I'm hearing offer will be accepted, okay? Offer accepted. So whatever offer this is, you will or they will accept it. So don't be afraid to go forward with that. Um, but do know there is going to be, you do need to have some deep conversations with the Queen of Swords here. And I do feel you, you are afraid to make this offer because you are afraid to be shut down okay you're afraid to be rejected and they may be feeling the same thing okay they don't want to be rejected either so it's i think i feel it's both like you're both with this masquerade and uh, the compliance maybe you're both having shields against one another so but there is a decision that needs to be made um and i feel you know um <clears throat> if it is um if you do decide to go towards your person or they decide to go with you like continue on with you um it will be a very prosperous it will be a prosperous union i do feel you're both business minded there's options there um but i oh they're saying you don't want to be you don't want them to have other options okay but this person does think about you as well okay so there we go there's your uh, tarot and oracle for today have a wonderful day talk to you all soon bye now